Nicki Minaj is not holding anything back because she threw some shade, honey, in her songs. Falling for you. When she said, picture you not listening when I said you would dread that, I mean, Lotto, use a chopped hoe, okay? And the barbs caught Lotto deleting her barbed tweets because y'all know Lotto was a barb. And she used to tweet a lot about Nicki Minaj back in the day that she was a barb. She wore a Barbie chain and she was like the number one barb fan. Now, with this album being dropped, Lotto tried to hurry to her Twitter to delete old tweets about being a barb and about Nicki. Because she knew this album was going to blow up and she would have looked like a clown, honey. But, you know, the barbs undefeated. They're faster than Amazon Prime prime they're faster than priority shipping honey because they caught lotto deleting old tweets about nikki and being a barb now you must feel some type of way i remember lotto shaded uh nikki calling her old and a bully and she mentioned in her song uh she thought you know i would kiss her butt she must then took her meds because Cardi B fans allegedly and Cardi B herself allegedly called Nikki a coke addict. And we all know Nikki doesn't do coke, period. This woman has been animated her whole entire career and that's who she is. But they want to spread this bullish narrative to make her look bad and they're failing because nikki's album is almost gold everyone is streaming nikki's album look at the marketing strategy some of the biggest franchise are actually celebrating Nicki minaj's album like target walmart you know mcdonald's dell laptop there were there are so many companies who are actually a part of the whole pink friday movement gag city mo <laughs> movement that was so funny but yet so creative like nikki is that girl the whole tracks on that album was given chef's kiss honey like cardi cardi is trending because of nikki if y'all don't know yes cardi is trending on twitter they actually said invasion privacy you know had a re-entry on the billboard charts because i think people want to do some comparison to say oh cardi is better than nikki or it could be cardi b fans who just doesn't want to have a competition they're actually streaming cardi b songs that way it could have some re-entry that way nikki album flops because they're miserable they don't want to see nikki win and it's so sad that you choose to stream cardi b songs you know currently when nikki just put out an album could you believe how slick and crazy is that why weren't you guys streaming cardi b songs all this time why wait for nikki to drop nikki's music were already streaming they were already trending you know barbs they don't have to wait until nikki drops an album to stream her songs that's legendary impact we were already streaming her music regardless of her dropping the spring friday 2 album okay so i think the bardi gang uh, crowd is going out very sad okay and cardi b I think she would just have to accept that Nikki is the queen of rap and just sit her silicone butt down and just, you know, do her. You know, I don't care. I think when you write your own rap, you're very talented. When you can sing like Beyonce and Whitney Houston, you're very talented. But if you sit in a studio and allow people to write your songs and they have to teach you how to say the words and you rap exactly what they wrote, I don't think you're talented. And that's my opinion. You don't teach an artist how to draw, honey. It all comes within the mind people were born with a gift i don't think cardi b was gifted as a rapper and i said what i said probably she's a good comedian or an actor okay god bless her heart but i don't think she's a rapper i don't think she's talented i don't care that's my opinion and my opinion is free but y'all i can't wait to go live and make a part two but so far let me know what y'all think about lotto deleting her old tweets about being a barb and Nicki minaj's shade towards her let me see those comments and see y'all next time thank you for sipping with us